following soccer a little bit less closely than you are. You're, in, you're, you're into watching, the World Cup. You're big watching time, some golf. Right? I'm watching some soccer. Yeah, so I know it's a big world event, and uh, the world down, down there in uh, Brazil, actually, it's been raining all day, but that's not going on here. And, of course, we've got the weekend coming up. So what am I doing? Looking at the whole state. Not looking at Ghana. Not looking at Brazil. I'm looking at good old Wisconsin here. And we look like we're going to be just fine during the day, at least in our area, as we head through the day on Saturday. Now, if you live way up in northwestern Wisconsin or far western Wisconsin, you're going to have a chance of an afternoon shower or thunderstorm there. But otherwise, 70, Milwaukee, 78, Madison, so a little bit cooler lakeside. Now, as far as Sunday is concerned, now we're going to start to increase the chance of storms for everybody in the state. But you notice we're warming it up as well. 80s to the south, 70s to the north, and our best chance of widespread rain looks to move in as we go into Sunday night as the front actually rolls its way on through. I'll get to that in a little bit for you. 75, that's what our average high should be. And how did we do yesterday? Well, you felt it at 80 degrees, and eventually the humidity dropped a little bit. Now, high temperatures off to our north and west, lower 70s. We can expect that today. Did I get rid of the 50 on the map? Yes, we did. It was 59 in Beaver Dam, now 62. 65 Burlington, same with Milwaukee, and 66 we're seeing. Not bad. So you've got temperatures in the 60s. Dew points in the 40s, that's awfully comfortable, and the sun feels nice. Even though it's this cool, remember, you can still get a hefty sunburn. Just letting you know. Satellite and radar, we are quiet, high pressure in charge. There's our next low pressure. That's going to come moving on through, especially as we head through the day and evening on Sunday, starting to kick up our chance of showers and storms. But remember, that's not here yet, and it won't be here on Saturday either. See, way off to the north and west, a chance of a shower or a thunderstorm during our day Saturday looks fine. Here's a look at future forecast heading through the day. I'm calling it nice. I know it's not one of the warmest, more humid day, but still it's comfortable breezy out there as well. Tonight, same story Saturday looking nice. Now notice off to our north and west. There's that chance of an afternoon shower or storm, but here's us quiet slight chance of an overnight shower or storm on Saturday night, and we start to increase the chance of storms going through the day Sunday, especially Sunday night as this whole system comes rolling on through. So I'm not talking about a weekend wash, and today is going to be completely dry, but breezy, 71 degrees. For tonight, 48, clear to partly cloudy. Open your windows at your own risk. For tomorrow, 70 degrees, 77 Waukesha Inlet, another mostly sunny day. Then for Sunday, chance of a shower or thunderstorm. It's going to be warmer as well, 80 degrees. And it looks like, again, our best chance of more widespread thunderstorm activity going to be on Sunday night. That's the actual system rolling on through and behind it. It looks quiet, at least for a day on Monday, and then we start to increase the chance of storms again Tuesday and Wednesday. So enjoy this nice weather. It's quiet and it's dry. We'll be right back.